Here's a question for you. Are your kids worried that they aren't as tall as their classmates? Dr. Lewis first has some tips to ease their concerns in this week's First with Kids. Parents have been hitting new heights with their questions about what to do when their child's concerned about being too tall or too short. Well, let me size up those questions and provide some information on this topic. Everyone grows at their own pace based on the genes they're born with. These genes determine just how fast your child will grow and how tall they're going to be. By the way, the two biggest growth spurts for a child occur in the first year of life when an infant can grow up to 10 inches in height and during puberty. Other factors that can influence growth, in addition to genes, include nutrition and occasionally hormonal imbalances, such as problems with thyroid or growth hormone levels in the body, but these are rare. Having a chronic illness such as celiac disease can also affect height. So what do I recommend if your child is bothered by their height? First and foremost, talk with your child if you think they're worried about their height. Rarely is there a growth problem that needs medical attention, but if you or your child are concerned, have your child's healthcare professional see if the growth in height is following the normal trajectory on their growth chart. If so, then reassurance is the best plan of action. If not, then blood tests or x-rays may be ordered to determine if there is a medical problem hampering your child's growth. One thing to ensure the best growth possible is to remind your child that good growth requires healthy nutrition, sleep, and exercise to ensure a maximum potential height is reached. Now, there's no evidence that taking extra vitamins or over-the-counter supplements helps. Even if a child feels they're too tall, they should still eat healthy and take care of themselves. No matter whether it's genes or another cause resulting in a height concern, please make sure your children still feel good about themselves by pointing out all the positive things they do. This is really the best way to convince them to stop worrying about how tall or short they are. In addition, teach them not to react to any bullying or name calling that might occur regarding their height. Telling them if they don't react, it's gonna make the bullying less exciting and usually those name callers will go away. You can also give them something to say that makes their height into a strength, such as shortness or tallness is only one of my many special qualities, just as it's been for my parents and my grandparents. Hopefully, tips like these will grow well with you and in turn with your child, no matter what their height happens to be. This is pediatrician Dr. Lewis First from the University of Vermont Children's Hospital, reminding you to always be first with your kids.